another event happening today, Joe, that's fantastic that a lot of folks, hopefully in Silicon Valley, will also be paying, paying attention to and maybe bidding on. Well, it's about time that we have our first <laughs> CFBC, our first NFT we're launching. I'm launching it today for two great causes. Ten years ago, today, CNBC lost a friend when Mark Haynes died. He was a fixture at CNBC from the network's launch until the day he passed away. And he's remembered for a lot of things, but certainly for the Haynes bottom when he called the low on, on the S&P 500 on March 10th, 2009. Come on, everyone. We've been I, waiting I for this. I think we're at a bottom. I really do. In honor of Mark, we're auctioning an NFT of that famous call from 2009. We're also selling a set amount of tokens for anyone who doesn't want to participate in the auction. It's all online now at mintable.app slash CNBC, as you can see right there. It goes live at 9 Eastern and ends at 1030 Wednesday morning. All proceeds go to Autism Speaks, a favorite charity of Mark. Uh, and the Council for Economic Education, which focuses on financial literacy, go to mintable.app slash CNBC. And this is a carbon neutral event. We're purchasing carbon offset uh, credits from a firm called Ariel to make sure we have no negative impact on the environment. Becky. OK, well, hold on. Are, are you guys this I'm going to bid, Joe. You're I'm going to bid. Just to create a floor, and also, I mean, well, maybe, maybe I'll be the winner. But I think of this just more as almost a charitable donation to Autism Speaks, which is a fabulous organization we, we all know and support, mm -hmm. uh, and also the, the Council for for for, uh, for Economic Literacy. So I don't know what you, I was thinking. A floor of I was going to either go in for a grand or five. The question is, do you think I get outbid at those prices? Is that is this is this key? going for is this <laughs> going to go for a hundred grand is, is, five hundred grand I mean, what that, are we talking that, about here is that five, the key that five you get grand, I think you yeah. got that I, I, when you said you're going can you're I win it, a, can I win with five though that's what I'm trying to figure out do you want to win or do you want to make sure someone outbids you I'm trying to figure out what you're saying oh that's good no I, I by the way I'll be I'll be in no 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 I'm going to be in okay. I'll, I, if I'll, I'll I'll make the donation either way meaning the donation will go to Autism Speaks. Uh, and and yeah. for right. financial Good literacy, ir, 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 irregardless of of whether I win or not, I'm just trying to just understand whether we think this is going to go for a better word than irregardless. But uh, when you said you're going to put a uh, when you said you're going to put a floor on it, I hope you're not talking ground floor, Sorkin. I'm th I'm th you should be at a, like a, a hundred floor type starter, I would think, like a Sears Tower. So we uh, go for a hundred. We got to put in a hundred grand then for this. No, I mean well, I the other not, thing is. I, don't I have to, get, I have to buy that. some, but I have to buy some Ethereum to do this. That's the other thing. I, I was just going to work that out during the commercial break. Do I have to buy Ethereum first? We got to check it out on the app. Yeah, you got to. Apparently, go I can use my credit slash. card. I don't even have to buy Ethereum first, which actually is helpful. Your so credit card opens the market work? even even more. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.